I go anywhere, anywhere with you, cause you feel my mind, or you feel my mind. Good morning, guys. It is October 1st, and I'm hungry this morning. Can you tell? I have an egg sandwich here with two eggs on the side with one slice of Velveeta, just cut in half. And I do have a slice of Velveeta on here as well. So I'm counting the Velveeta as three because we know if you have two, it goes up to three. Weight Watchers math. And I'm having my one smart point cup of coffee that I've been working on since six this morning. And the bun is three and the bacon is two. So three, four, five, six, seven, eight smart points for this, nine with this. So yeah, I'm not going to be able to eat many snacks today, but I was hungry this morning. This is what is for breakfast. Right, Luna? Is that right, Luna? She thinks she's going to get some snacks. She's mistaken. Gosh, you guys, I just got these out of the dryer. And putting them back on those things is crazy hard. I got one on. It took me about 15 minutes to get one on. And that's the smaller cushion. <sighs> I'm not looking forward to this job. But man, do they look so much cleaner now. So happy with that. But it's difficult. It's difficult to get those on there. Oh, are you tired, Jack? Oh, you poor kitty. You have so much to do today. Are you tired, Luna? Are you tired? Are you? What's going on? I don't think she liked hearing me complaining about getting that cushion thing on there. <laughs> that's what I'm doing right now. It'll probably take me a couple hours, but that's what I'm doing. I got this one on in record time, guys. I think it maybe took me a minute and a half. Minute and a half, maybe. I found the key. <laughs> I'll show you what I did. I took this, the cushion, and I turned it literally inside out. And then I laid it, kind of matched it up with each of the ends here, and I just laid it right on top of here and grabbed this end, and I just started pushing it down. And then I just kind of flipped it up on its side and just started pushing. <laughs> Flipped it upside down and did this side. And that was it, guys. I mean, you see how fast that was? I was fighting and fighting and fighting doing it the other way. The hardest part was zip, zipping this up. But I just kind of hold it together and... That's it. It's done. Less than a minute. Seriously. As I was cleaning up and vacuuming and putting away all the toys that I have here for the babies, I noticed that, oh yeah, I didn't clean the toys after the kids left because this is what I found. Peanut butter. Peanut butter. So it looks like I have to clean the toys. I'm just going to wipe that off for now. Usually what I do is put all these tracks. These, these um, are, this is a set that my oldest son had when he was little. And it's just all kinds of train tracks and stuff. It's all plastic pieces from Little Tykes. They no longer sell this set, I don't think. Anyway, I have never seen it for a while. But um, I just take the whole thing, fill up my bathtub with some bleach water, and just dump it all in there and leave it soak for about an hour. And then rinse it off and dry it, and it's good. <laughs> and the same thing with these. these. I've had these since Nick was a baby. They're just the huge Lego blocks. The kids love playing with them. So I keep them here and... Just, you know, that's where they stay all the time down here in the corner. So I got my couch put back together. That couch put back together. Feels so much better. Now I have to dust this because it's really dusty. So I have to dust that and then finish vacuuming. Well, hello. Hello, Luna. Hello, Luna. I got the rugs in the washer now. So hopefully they'll be dried up real soon. We had a spill there with some milk that I should probably take my carpet cleaner down here and try and get that cleaned up. You guys, I just unboxed this massive box of delicata squash. I think there's like 16 or 17 squash I counted. 
Wow, amazing. And look at this huge one. Oh my goodness, it's so huge. Like it is it's tremendously huge. I'm having some delicata squash for lunch. I am actually in the basement because I'm still cleaning down here. That is for lunch. And it's I'm gonna count this as one smart point because I have the seasonings on there. Guys, I'm having chili for supper tonight. I have the tortilla strips in there and then a little bit of cheese. So this is three smart points tonight. These are the Quest bars, and I'm having one of these for a snack. Guys, I ended up having two of these. I bought two of them, and I had them both. Oh my gosh. But anyway, I am still only one point over for the day, so I'm not going to be beating myself up about it, I guess. <laughs> I should have bought. I shouldn't have bought two. I did, and I ate them both. I should have known better. So I ate these both, and they, are, they came up as five smart points apiece. So that was ten smart points. It was not 11, which is a good thing. So I ended the day with 24 smart points today. Normally I should get 23. Good evening, guys. It is October 1st, October 1st already. This year has went by so fast. I am starting a month long challenge with Gina and Sandy. It's gonna be really fun, you guys, because we're gonna do a lot of um, bickering back and forth, I think. I think um, I really want to win this, so I'm going to try really hard to kick their butt. I want you guys to play along with me as well, and we can beat their groups. This is Team Carrie, Sandy has Team Sandy, Gina has Team Gina. So we are going to have some fun this month. We are going to post our weight every day. And I know a lot of you may disagree with posting weight every day or even weighing yourself every day, but this is just for October. It's not gonna be like throughout the entire rest of the year or anything like that. It's just for October, just to have a little bit of fun to try and encourage all of us to not goof up on that one day thinking, oh, we have three or four or five days to get back to our weight before weigh-in, right? So I think weighing in every day is going to keep us all accountable for this month. And I'm really curious as how well it will work for me because I'm really competitive, I really am. And I always wanna win. Sandy won our week long thing. I came in second and Gina brought up the rear. If that says anything, I have to step my game up because I need to beat Sandy. She's pretty good at this. She is pretty good at this. So I want you guys to post your weight below, your starting weight, and then every day come back and comment on all of our videos and let us know the weight that you're at. And we're gonna add up all of the weights below in the comments down below. My head is hurting right now, you guys. I have a really bad headache and I've been drinking water. Water. What we're gonna do is we're gonna weigh in once a week. No, we're not. We're gonna weigh in every day. Oh my goodness. Okay, you guys, Gina explained it so well. You gotta check out her Battle of the Bulge introduction video because I didn't make one. I didn't. This is pretty much my introduction video because of the fact that I have super slow internet and there's no way it would have been out before tomorrow anyhow. So I wanted to get this video up and uploading because if I try to upload two videos, then it's like snail slow. It's like really super slow. It'll take two days to upload videos if I try to upload two of them check out her video she explains it so well the main thing is guys post your comments down below with your weight your starting weight on this video right now and then every day come back and post what you lost post your weight and then what you lost and then your current weight if you do not want to post your weight that's fine just post what you lost or what you gained or whatever because you know weighing in every day we're bound to have some gains here and there I, I have a feeling we're going to have some gains and that's okay. So if you don't want to put your weight, just don't bother doing that. Just put your what you lost or what you gained down below. If you want to put your weight, that's great. That's awesome. We are definitely putting our weight out there. We're going to get on the scale, take a picture of the scale. And that's the picture that we're going to post every single day. And I'm not sure where in the video it's going to be, probably towards the middle end area, somewhere around there. Okay. So how did I do today? I did pretty darn well today. However, I did have two quest bars. I know, bad way to start up the week, right? So I'm probably gonna have a gain tomorrow because of that. 
because of that. I was just so hungry for Quest Bars, you guys. I was so hungry for Quest Bars. And I thought, okay, I'll get one for today and one for tomorrow. I ate them both. I ate them both today. Good thing that I didn't buy a whole box of them. I only bought two, so that's that's okay. So I had two Quest Bars, and I didn't put them in my tracker yet, but I'll let you know how many they were for two of them. <laughs> Otherwise, I did really well today. Other than that, I stuck to my plan. I drank my water. This is my second cup for today. I'll probably end up getting another one because it is kind of early in the night. It's like 7.30. Oh, it's 8 o'clock already. Mm. And that is it for today. I am going to put my starting weight right here coming up next. So that is my starting weight and we will see what the scale brings me tomorrow. And like I said, I jump up and down all the time. All week long, I was jumping up and down with the girls. <laughs> be sure to play along, guys. Join my Facebook group, too, because I'll be talking about it there as well. The link is down below for that. That is it for the night. I am going to close it here. Be sure to like and subscribe if you haven't already. And be sure to share this if you think it may help anybody. We will talk to you guys tomorrow. Be sure to watch for the weight. You know, it's okay to kick their butt a little bit. But... Keep it friendly. Keep it all friendly. We like to be friendly around here. We will talk to you guys tomorrow. Bye. I go anywhere, anywhere with you. Cause you feel my mind. Oh, you feel my mind. We could build a dream, start up something new. Let the old be dead. Let the shadows be my head. When the world is on your shoulders and you feel like falling over, just come a little closer. I'll be there for you, I'll be there for you Cause when